Well, hi there folks and welcome to the August market wrap. And not only is the weather warming up, which we're really pleased about, but also the property market definitely is behaving the same way. And although the figures from August from CoreLogic suggest that the market uh, contraction has eased for the second month in a row in the wake of the COVID period. Despite all of this, uh, we still met around 600 buyers just last weekend alone, spread over roughly 40 properties and 2,200 for the month of August, which allowed us to trade over 38 properties with a few happening on the quiet. Now you often hear about days on market being reported, but not very many people actually explain what that means. Right now, as a collective at Cunningham's, we have an average days on market of 24 days. We're achieving a price that a vendor's ecstatic with within a 24 day period. So that's a figure that we're really proud of. Not only that, we're selling 97% of the properties that we're actually listing, compared to a market average of 85%. So that's a figure that we're, again, extremely proud of because it shows that we're having honest conversations around pricing from the beginning and we're actually executing the right strategies to sell your particular property at any given day. Now, it's really no longer a question about whether we're in a strong market or we're not. I think the question really now is why are we in this environment that is uh, contrary to what the macroeconomic view of the property market is. And in speaking to a couple of colleagues from the inner west in the Balmain sort of Roselle area and also the eastern suburbs, they're reporting exactly the same as what we're seeing on the northern beaches. Along with John Cunningham, we've done a lot of homework on why we think this is the case to bring you some real data about the levels of stock that are currently on the northern beaches compared to say 10 years ago. And we've written a bit of an article in our blog uh, available on our website at Cunningham's, but I'll also post a link in the, uh, in the notes or the comment section for you to have a read. It's a really interesting read and it gives some perspective as to why we're in this uh, environment right now with such low stock and why that underpins value here on the Northern Beaches. So we saw a number of strong sales in the month of August with 27 Arthur Street selling for 1.8 million. That was a three bed, really beautiful cottage, um, as well as a, a home in Cromer Heights, a big five bed home that we discussed in last month's market update. That ended up selling under auction conditions with four registered bidders uh, for just over 2.1. So as always, if you have any questions or would like to reference our recent sales, feel free to go to our website or any of the properties that we currently have on the quiet. I'd be more than happy to assist you. So I'll see you out and about and see you next month.